Paul, that must be so frustrating for you. You had some really good chances today. Played well, just said to Phil, we played really well. I enjoyed watching us play. Do you know, obviously, like everyone knows, the biggest part of the game scoring goals. And unfortunately, today, we had massive chances in the game. Really big, big chances that take the game away from the opposition when you score. But we played well today, we really did. And it's so unfortunate that we've come off the end of a defeat because we certainly didn't deserve that. Yeah, it probably says it all that the home goalkeeper got man of the match. He was outstanding and good luck to the kid. He was outstanding. Like some, I think he made three saves in the first half that were absolutely phenomenal. But we've had chances to score and unfortunately I felt and you watched the same game as me. I didn't think we were under any pressure at all in the game, I've got to be honest. We coped really well with what Boreham Woods had their threats. I thought our two centre-halves were outstanding. I thought our two full-backs played really well. And our midfield three took control of the game. We created big chances and you've got to put them away. And unfortunately today, I understand our supporters, like I say, they get a little bit agitated where they want changes. Do you know, for 10 and 15 minutes to go, but I felt we were playing well. So maybe I watch a different game than some fans. Just that final finish missing today, do you think that'll just come with time? Is it just about working? Listen, don't forget, we've sold Tish Manga this week. We've got Danny Rowe just returning to the club, who's obviously not fit at the minute. And we've got a Santi out injured. So if you're looking for firepower, there's three big ones that we need to be placed in some capacity. And I'm sure as our supporters are the logical ones, because I'm sure we have got a lot of logical fans, we know we're doing our best to do that. Yeah, are you hoping to answer the squad this yeah, week if you can? 100%. But I don't just add for the sake of it. Mm. We've got so many good players, we've got so many good things happening at the club that we must make sure that when we bring signings in, it's to make us better. It's not just for the sake of signing a player. Is there anything close? I, I could tell you, every, I could say we're signing three tonight to keep you happy. Do you know, I, I'm always a believer in me. I think sometimes you've got to lick your wounds. Today was a tough one to take because we played well today. We had great support and credit to our supporters. You know, 95% of them are superb. You know, I do think 5% of them watch an absolute different game and are mad. And it suggests sometimes if you want to be that vociferous against your team, then during the game, you're not a good supporter, not in my opinion. And my office is open every day of the week for anyone who wants a knock. Come and have a cup of tea and I'll discuss anything that they want. Uh, just for final one, Asante, is that a serious groin. injury? Oh, groin training Thursday. So unfortunately, we travel today without, obviously, Cabby because he's been sold. Without Tishmanga, obviously. Without Asante, without Danny Rowe. And as you know, with most teams, firepower is everything in most divisions. And at the minute, it's a department where we're short in, but we will look mm. to strengthen. I mean, the good news is, at least you've got an opportunity to bounce back quickly. Welcome on Tuesday. Should be a great game. Yeah, not just all good games. You know, they're all tough. There's not much in any games you play in the division. Do you know, but today was probably the first time for a bit we've travelled away from home and played well. Mm. And I enjoyed watching us play. And we had them under pressure for long periods of the second half. And sometimes you're just waiting for that moment. Or more importantly, that player that we all know, the club's had plenty of them. And in the past six or seven years, we've had a lot of them that don't fire anything. And I certainly won't be trying to sign more of them.